Okay, peeps. Oh my god. Ooh, I'm not looking so good, but whatever. I never look good. Whenever I stand in this spot exactly, I never look good. But I am throwing down in the kitchen right now, and I had to document because I don't know what it was. I just got a surge of culinary motivation. So these are about to be done. But let me show you what I made. I'm like dying. So let me turn the light on here. <gasps> I think our light is out. Oh, wait. It's on. So here we go. I am making, I made green beans. I usually like the regular green beans, but I just did the French style. Um, so I cooked those and then I drained them. And then I did the Daya Alfredo. And this is the first time I'm trying the Alfredo. So usually I would do like mac and cheese because it's kind of like that like famous Dave's food type day. I'm doing my potatoes right now. They need to be strained and then I'm going to mash them for make mashed potatoes. But I made these homemade cornbread and cornbread muffins and I'm dying. Like I literally did all the ingredients and measured them out and stuff and they're like so good. So keeping those warm and then I'm di I did um for chicken I did the what's it called I'm actually gonna take it out right now but for chicken I did the what's it called whatever that's called Ch crispy chicken patties and that always tastes good with like hot sauce so I'm gonna take this out hold on and I'll be right back okay mashed potatoes are done I'm gonna put a little more pepper in there but that is the spread ladies and gentlemen What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? What's up? Oh. Okay. Wow. All right. What's up, everyone? So, I put a plant here. It's not real, obviously. Well, it's more obvious when you get up close. I bought this off Amazon. And I have one in my bathroom, but I thought it was cute. I don't know if like that's where it's gonna stay, the plant, but I bought like a macrame thing. I don't know how I feel about that. So I just went to the gym and we love that for me. And I'm thinking I have to edit a vlog today. So I'm gonna edit a vlog for this channel, Vlogception. Um, what else was I gonna do? Oh, I'm gonna research for an MLM video. I was researching all this morning about the law surrounding it, and I was on all these like MLM lawyer websites that typically protect these companies. I found the lawyer group or like the firm that represents um, Mel Melo Luca. So I don't even know what the hell that one is. But anyway, I gotta find out what I'm gonna do for dinner. So last night we had kind of a crazy night with the potatoes, the mac and cheese, the chicken patties, the green beans, the, you know, all of it. We all remember the epic dinner I made last night. Who could forget? I mean, who could forget? I really gotta figure it out because I'm really hungry. It's five o'clock. I'm gonna be laying down in my bed soon so oh i just got a message from beautycon hold on a minute guys oh i gotta show you this speaking of beautycon they sent me this i don't know how they got my address but they did <laughs> i'm gonna show you these two things actually so let's go over here um but it's juicy couture they came out with a makeup brand so middle school me is absolutely shaking in my boots okay I'm shaking in my Juicy Velour sweatsuit, which by the way, I had a Juicy Velour sweatsuit. It was in a time when my mom would not buy me Hollister, she would not buy me Abercrombie. I couldn't believe that my mom could do something like that to me um, by not buying me Hollister. I was disgruntled for sure as a middle schooler not being able to wear Hollister. But the one thing that I did have and I cherished, I had a Juicy Couture bracelet, which I still have and I could probably go find it. And I had a Juicy Couture sweatsuit and I absolutely rocked it. Like, I wore it every day. So, I need to find that. I don't know where it went, but look at this packaging. Are we screaming? And by the way, one of my favorite perfumes ever is the Juicy Couture, uh, whatever that one famous one is from them. 
Oh, clearly my favorite. I can't freaking remember what it is. But okay, so this is a glitter cream lipstick. Here is the pack. This is like nostalgic right now. So here's the packaging. Love. And this is the, oh wow. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Glitter all around it. This is like a, it's like, it's called Crown Jewel 01. This is more of like a showpiece, in my opinion. Um, we have the Bling Queen highlighter. So there she is. And, oh, it's very pink. See that? It's very, very, very pink. Very, very, very pink. So, these are very bold statements, but like, you know what I could see this just being so, like, put, put this on like a runway model, I'm not saying that you can't wear it if you aren't a runway model, but like, oh wait, actually, you know what, that looks pretty good now. But I can just see this like backstage at a fashion show, they're putting this on the models before they walk out, like, anyway, I can dream, right? So, this is called Hidden Gem, and whoa absolutely I love it look at that there's a lot of glitter lipsticks that are made but this one is so overtly glittery but the inside it doesn't look like it's inside it's just like an overspray on the outside there's the packaging again and then here is oh I opened this one already you're gonna freaking this is like this is the crown jewel right here what is this called my shining armor <gasps> This is it right here, boys. Like, huh? This, it's a scepter. Bippity bippity boom. Bippity bippity boom. Bippity bippity boom. Okay, so this is a, I believe a, I don't know, lip gloss or something. I, I'm gonna be honest, I'm never gonna put this on my lips one day because guess what? This is staying on my vanity and it's never coming off. This is amazing. <laughs> Oh my god, the glitter is in here. You guys, I don't know where they sell this. I think they might sell it at Macy's. If you go um, and if you see this stand, just stop by it and like look at this one called My Shining Armor 02 and just like pick it up and just go like this. Just rotate it. And if somebody says you look crazy, ignore them. So I also got my, my BoxyCharm, which is, they're usually not that good. <laughs> But I feel like this is just an unusually good box. So they have the Moda Pro. I'm just going to go quick through it. Moda Pro 5-piece deluxe eye kit. So you can never have enough eye brushes. This is a brand. I think that they sell it at Walmart. But these are really good. And somebody just recently said that this was one of their favorite brushes. was one of these. So love. They have a Hank and Henry. I actually am very excited about this. It's a, um, oh, this is a black liquid liner. I thought this was brown. Okay, hey, maybe don't do a brown top for a black eyeliner. Just maybe don't do that. Maybe don't do that. Um, we have the Dr. Brandt Hydrobiotic Recovery Sleeping Mask. I'll be honest, I do not care about this whatsoever, but we have it and I'll probably use it. Deeply hydrates and moisturizes to reduce signs of redness and irritation. Okay. Here's the thing I'm excited about, okay? And some people did not get this, but I did because I'm lucky because I just am the best and they know it. So this is like one of the best things I've ever seen in a boxy charm. I'm not gonna lie. And this is like, oh wait, we got another thing too, sorry. Billion dollar brows, okay, brow pen. Anyway, so we got this. Too Faced Natural Face. Well, some people got it, like I said. Not everybody got it. Only the elite got this, okay? So, I didn't even have this. This is amazing. Look at this. First of all, this is girthy. Okay, we love to, we love to call our makeup girthy. <laughs> um, smells good. It's kind of, I mean, it smells like Play-Doh. I don't know if they were trying to make it smell like vanilla, but they have two highlighter shades, it appears. One you could use as like a, or either of these you could use as a blush topper. They've got, it looks like, two blushes. This is like a shimmery bronzer, but then this is a matte bronzer over here. And they're really pretty. I mean, they're really pretty. The mirror on this is insane, though. Like, this is a nice mirror. And this is just the packaging and then the heart right here. 
you guys, I gotta love it. So anyway, I got that, and um, I do have a BoxyCharm code. Don't go my, don't get in my shot. I do have BoxyCharm. I will not, I will not. Not, miss, I'm not gonna, not gonna waste, or, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna miss, miss no. Is it miss? I no. think it's not gonna waste. I'm not gonna. It's not waste. I'm not gonna blunt, blunt. What's from Hamilton? Oh, Jarvis, you're so addicted to Hamilton. You, you are. You're the one quoting. Oh, it's so embarrassing how addicted you are. Um, what were they saying? Anyway, yeah, I have a boxy charm link down below, actually. So, wow, this is actually looking pretty good. This highlighter. At first, I was like, what? It's a little pink, but now I'm looking at it. I'm like, that's actually effective. So anyway, thanks for watching this segment. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I don't know how to feel about what I did. I just did a bad thing. <laughs> I regret the thing I did. I moved my desk over here. I don't know what I was doing. Why did I do this? You. You. Stupid. I honestly feel stupid. Like, does this look really bad, you guys? I mean, it's fine, right? It's like, it opened this up a little bit. I guess, I mean, this looks weird. I know this looks weird. That the fact that it's like overlapping like this. I don't know for the life of me why it's uneven, but I wanted to see the lake. That's the only thing, I just, I was desperate. And I tried moving my desk right here where the tree is, it looks bad. Trust me. So, let me move back. Let me move back a bit. What do we think? Maybe what I need to do, I mean, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Right? These chairs are bad. These chairs are awful. I don't know, you guys. Ugh. Whatever. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's so beautiful. Oh my god, it is so... It's so... Oh my god, they need to clean these fudging windows or I'm going to lose it. That is amazing. You can't even see. It's not picking up. No, it's not picking up. I cannot, boo. We need to wake up every day early, honey. We need to. You need to stop sleeping in. Come on, let's go eat. Show them your morning routine. Come on, let's go show them your morning routine. What do you do after the gym? Get a super big gulp <laughs> from 7-Eleven, of course. I worked out today. If I can only be as toned as I am tone deaf. <laughs> What'd you think of that joke? Not your best. Not my best? Good morning. So, I took some advice from my last the vlog and you guys said he was bored so I forgot I had this toy that's like an automatic um, god it's like an automatic laser pointer so I put it in this dark hallway so you could actually see it and now I just have it going but yeah he's loving it he's he's busy he was meowing like crazy so I'm like alright I'm gonna try it today we're gonna try to get him to go so yeah, and I also have a bunch of trash at my door, but this is what he's up to this morning. Hopefully it'll get his zooms out. It goes for like 10 minutes or so. See, he doesn't see it's on, that it's like where it is, it's on him. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. So anyway, that should keep him very busy. Anyway, I'm just making breakfast. I got a lot of editing to do today, so. That sounds a blast. Not really. I hate editing. Oh my god. Okay. 
It's Saturday. Uh -huh. <laughs> I literally just got so excited. <laughs> I'm playing World of Warcraft. Don't mind me. I've literally been playing it for the last two days. I'm back to being addicted, even though I said I kicked my addiction. I didn't. I lied. Okay. So we just ordered from this place, and I can't believe it was even on Uber Eats because it was all the way in Bucktown, which is like a 30 minute drive almost. Oh my, look at this. I have been wanting to try this place. My mom's gonna be so jealous. She wanted to try it. Wow, you can't actually see anything. Dude, this is like all vegan Mexican food. All vegan, look at that. I got so much stuff. Hopefully it's in here. I'm dying. Boo's going absolutely fucking berserk. What's new? Okay, I'm gonna show you, let me unbox. I got a vegan chicken quesadilla. What are these? Those are my two tacos. Those are your nachos. Where are you going? I got a chicken taco. Wait, you're not eating? Oh, I got tamales. Wait. I'm glad you got all your food. I forgot I got tamales. <laughs> okay, tamales. Probably. And then this taco thing. Oh, two tacos in here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at this. And it was like almond milk cheese or something. I don't know what this is though. Chicken and I did like a beef one. And then I got beans. Beans and rice. Dude, that looks so so good. Okay, update on the food. Eh. Eh. Wasn't that great? And they forgot the chips. So. Oh, can you show them your mug? Yeah. You, you can just take this off for a second, maybe. Hey, get ladies, new mug for the horde. That's a World of Warcraft, if anyone wants to know. You I got to show it. Your, what's on your computer right now? What? What's on my computer? Anyway, so I just want to give you an update on the food. Not that anyone cares. But, oh my god, major party over in that apartment. Really? Yeah, it looks like they're playing like some kind of beer pong. Oh my god, what are they? No, yeah, you can see them from here. Yeah, no, they're actually adults. Like they're playing uh, beer pong. They just high fives me on Saturday night. I'm the neighborhood watch. Um, yeah, so I sit over here now. This is my new desk background. What was I gonna say? Um, it's crazy watching people play beer pong because what I did today was I played World of Warcraft all day and I got ice cream scoopers, like the ones, the nice ones with like the trigger on them where you're like ready to go. So then you when you scoop them in, it's like a perfect scoop. I've always wanted them. So I finally just decided to pull the trigger. What the fuck are you talking about in your vlog? <laughs> just stop. <laughs> What's please. wrong with what I'm saying? Look at me, look at me. Please, please stop. What? They need to know. I'm, I'm just talking, I'm comparing our lives, me and the other people over there. I'm watching them play beer pong at 10.15 and what I did today was I got ice cream scoopers and guess what? I always told myself once I get those really nice like scoopers that I wouldn't have made it. I always measure how well I'm doing in life by the kind of kitchen equipment that I have. And I'm doing pretty freaking well right now, but I do, there's still some things I want. I want a nugget ice maker, need a, a nugget ice maker. And I wouldn't mind like a really nice lunchbox. <laughs> um, did I tell you guys I watched, hold on, I'm just on a rant. I'm on a tangent because I've got nothing to do on Saturday night. But so I watch, I'm addicted to actually, every night before I go to bed, I watch kids school lunch videos and there's this one person i watch it's like this family i guess and she makes these like crazy elaborate lunches and they're like oh wait it's like a sandwich with a face and it's cut out and like the fruits all shaped different shapes and stuff it's crazy and like themes should be like it'll be like christmas truck theme i'm like that's specific but you gotta respect it so anyway 
I watch them every night, but it's, I have a love-hate because she has her kids come home and then like she, to show us what they ate or if it was success, a successful lunch or not, she's like, she brings home their lunches and shows what they ate. But it's crazy because when she eats, when they eat, like when they don't eat enough of her lunch that she made, you can tell she's kind of like, what the fuck? So you didn't, she's like kind of like, oh, so you didn't like your celery. What's going on? You didn't like your celery. Why is it all left? Like, and these are just like young kids. I'm just kind of like, sheesh, like. I don't like celery that much either. And you just gave me peanut butter. I mean, that, that's not enough. I need ranch, you know what I'm saying? So anyway. Um, yeah, so life's going... His life's pretty crazy right now. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> telling, I'm telling them about my school lunches that I... Um, you talking about Miss Pickles? No, that's Prickly Pear on TikTok. I'm addicted to TikTok as well, but... Um... What else was I talking about?